What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and I'm excited to continue Sorceress. We are going to be having a bunch of episodes on Sorceress because I have gotten back to doing the story that we never finished. As you can see, somehow I lost the Yennefer name. Someone beat me to it. I'm still a little tilted, but this is like a day after, so I'm not as tilted. I stole the Witcher family name from myself, so I'm not really mad about that. I own the Witcher name on PlayStation, so I own Witcher and Witcher BDC. So, kind of like that I own both of them. Kind of wish they would have just left it the same. Who cares if... But, I, I... Whatever. What? Whatever. Point is, is that we're now Yennefer BDC over here, and it just means I was the original Yennefer. That's all that it means. I'm not... It... I was the original Yennefer, because Xbox came out before PlayStation, so... Whatever. Part 2. If you guys ever have anything tip-wise you want to tell me, feel free. Doesn't offend me. I actually appreciate it more than you think. Um, I like when people tell me when I'm being an idiot, or when I need to be doing certain things um, that I'm not doing, such as... Shout out, I'm going to get the name correct because I want to give you proper credit, my dude. Let me get, let me pull it up here because he commented. So, I want to give a shout out to my dude, Mika Onalainen. Okay, I apologize, got that wrong. But, he told me to get Kudum over Nova, which I went ahead and did. We have Tri Nova. First thing I'm going to upgrade, or Tri Kudum. First thing we're going to do is upgrade to Tet. Kudum. So this gives plus 43 extra AP against monsters since I'm mostly PvE. That's all I need. Um, I do have the... I did actually buy the stupid uh, Tri Nova. So I gotta sell that now. But point is, is that we did pick up the Kudum. The, the Tri Kudum. So I'm happy about that. So, we have started doing the side quests, or the quests here, the main quests here. So, we're on Bashim Warriors, we're going to go through Valencia, then we're going to go through Camasylvia, and hopefully we're able to do all of it. I should be able to do all of it. Um, I'm going to take some time here in the future. I'm hoping maybe this weekend or early next week to learn Sork a little bit better. Um, how to play a little bit better than how I play now. So, hopefully, I can start playing a little bit better than what I do now. That's the point. And when that occurs, hopefully, we will, uh, I'll start to, to not make people mad. <laughs> I appreciate all you guys watching my mediocre gameplay on this game. Why won't it? Okay, I'm just stuck in the middle of those guys. But, yeah, I'm hoping to get a little bit more experienced. I feel like it's time to put in the effort to become better at this game than I am right now. So, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take... Why did it... Oh my gosh. Sometimes I hit button combos, and it's simply just my own fault, but I'm just like, why? Why well, you gotta be the way you are? These things are actually really easy now. Uh, <laughs> I upgraded all my crap, and these things are, like, super easy. I remember when... I couldn't farm these things effectively because they just were a little bit too good for me. But now I just like absolutely work them. I think those that was like the level 58 towards 59. So not that long ago and I don't think my equipment's got that much better so. Maybe I just am playing the character a little bit better. I don't know. But I don't feel like it was that long ago that that was what I was doing was farming these idiots. I really like the farm here. I think it's a really good farm. But, yeah, I, I don't quite remember... Why did not... Hello? Oh, I don't have enough resource. I gotta get better on that... That front. Is making sure that I... Don't run out of that. Out of my mana. That's probably the thing that I do the worst in this game. Is the, man, the mana stamina... Or the mana... Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. The mana management. I was saying stamina instead of the word management. But the sta the mana management is probably what I do the worst in this game. It's just 
not one of the things that I do well. Especially on my Sork. I think I did pretty well with stamina management on some of the other characters that I've done. But on this, on my Sork, which is weird because it's the thing that I play the most. But on my Sork, I feel like my management is just kind of lackluster. It's not very good. So that's something I definitely have to work. But with everything, as we play through and I start to play on the character more, I'm hoping we'll uh, we'll get more used to a lot of the stuff again, and maybe we won't suck as much. That's the goal. But yeah, we're going to have a lot of more Sork episodes because I want to progress it. I want to get it set up so when uh, we get new content, I'm able to do it. And we're not like, oh, yeah, I never beat Cam and Sylvia, but let me skip to this new content that just came out in the game. So, uh, to avoid that, that's what I'm that's what I'm doing now, is trying to get caught up. And then we'll go back to other characters and work on them. Meanwhile, we'll still be playing Sork. I really don't want to take time off from Sork like I have been doing in the past, so definitely going to try to keep up a little bit more with playing my Sork. And like this... I definitely could have done this a long time ago. I didn't actually have to do a whole lot with those Basilisks that got me here. So that was what we were stuck on. We were stuck on the Basilisk part of this set. Uh, where you're up, I'll show you where it is in case you don't know. I mean, most people are probably past where I am in this game. But, um, let's see if I can kill these guys real quick. Okay, so let me pull up the map really quick and show you. So we're down here at Bashim's. There's Altanova over, Altanova over there. Here is Basilisk Den. That's where we were. That's where I was stuck at. Um, because those enemies were just a little bit too strong for me to fight. And then I never really went back there when I got to like 50. I think I got there at like 55. And then I never really tried to do it again. So probably explains why at level 60 I am so ridiculously overpowered for it. But that's just how it goes. So we need to kill 12 more throwers. Hey, stop running away, thrower. You're, I, I need to kill you. Kill that. Let's get down in the pit. Might as well use this. Probably my favorite skill in all of Black Desert. That I have used. It's not the best. I just really like that skill. Okay, so there's all the throwers down. I'm going to kill a little bit more here. You can see we progressed. I've gotten up to 11% of the way to 61 I think the goal is really, once I get to 62, I really won't care what level I am. But that's the where I want to get to, is 61 right now. And hopeful, I'm hoping that I can get there, I don't know, by April, May? 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 Is that a realistic goal? I don't even, I think that's a little bit too long, but maybe, maybe May. I feel like that's, that's a generous, like, amount of time to give myself, but who knows? Maybe that's what I'll choose to do. I do like that the spin to win, you can just spin to win right through these idiots. Back down this path. But yes, I... Once I get to 62, I don't think I'll care a whole heck of a lot about what level I am. Um, at a certain point in this game, the level ceases to make an extreme amount of difference. But I know level 60 was big because it unlocked new skill stuff. And I need to grind up kills anyway because I need to get skill points so that I can invest into more stuff. My favorite little jumps here, where you gotta, like, time this correctly. There we go. I don't know why they structured that like that. Okay, so we can go ahead and turn this quest in. I'll see what the next quest is. Uh, Bashim's Lost Honor. So, we need to learn about Bashim's and Centaur history. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and cut ahead till the next, um, kill-related quest. Because I don't think me running around talking to different people is going to be all that exciting for anybody, so I'm going to go ahead and do that, and I'll be back in just a hot second with the next uh, kill quest. Alright guys, so after a lot of dialogue quests and one really small kill quest that I didn't think it was worth showing, we are in a brand new area to me, so yeah, I never ventured up here to this part of the map, so this is definitely new. We unlocked uh, deserted or de de yeah deserted city of Run, Run Gateway intersection Shakatu, and now we're up here at Gaha's Bandit Lair, which I never did before. So I'm actually interested with this because I have never been up here. So 
yeah, this is all new. Brand new, happy to get up here. I'm assuming I should be able to absolutely slaughter these things. Yeah. Um They're they're like the they're like about as good as the Bashims guys, but they're in like smaller packs and they, I don't think they have as much health. I'm assuming they probably do equivalent damage, but when I can just spin to win through a group of you and kill you all, probably not a recipe for success for you guys. Did that thing just use my own spell against me? I want to kill it because it's a violent. Go. Oh, it just sat in there. That was perfect. I don't even have my shield on. Probably should do that. I don't like... I like that skill, but it takes forever in a day to use it. Would you just die, hello? Oh my gosh, you're so annoying, just die. I'm gonna hit him with this. We're just gonna, we're just gonna stand here and trade. Oh my god, this thing is so strong. It doesn't do like any damage. It just is really strong from a health standpoint. Like, hello? Would you, would you die, please? That's not the one I wanted to use, but it's gonna get off anyway, so that's good. And then I got... No. Hello? Would you chill, buddy? This is about enough. Like, hello? Can you die? Might as well kill these guys real quick. While I'm still fighting the stupid shadow of Gahas, how are you this strong? Literally facing off against Zeus in the flesh. I am literally facing off against Zeus. What is happening? literally am 1v1ing Zeus. No. How do you have this much health? I can't take this seriously. How do you have this much health? Okay, I need to kite these guys over here. Hello, everyone. Can you please be useful? I need to use you to get health. Oh, okay. Then I got knocked out of it. I didn't get knocked out of that attack a single time this whole entire fight. And then now I get knocked out of it. Actually getting my ass handed to me now. Hello, can I get up? Thank you. Okay, maybe don't introduce random other enemies when riflemen are an option. Okay, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. We gotta kill these riflemen, because they're just smoking my shit. Leave me alone for one second. My god, you are so annoying. I'm using it again. How are you still not dead? I swear this thing is actually Zeus. Like... What is happening? How do you have this much health? Thank you! Finally! Died! Holy shit! I was facing Zeus and- For as weak as these enemies are, literally just face Zeus reincarnated. That shit was wild. Like, look at that. These things die in, like, two hits to my regular attacks. Like, I can't- That's just- That's- That's enough. That thing was literally Zeus. I probably should go to, like, the main concentration of enemies where it's trying to take me, so let's go there. Let's see where this wants to take me, and we'll see what kind of mob density we got over there. So we're going to actually go into the pit. we got big dudes here. I'm going to kill these guys. I want to kill the the decent sized groups. Okay, so this is where, well, that's where the quest is suggesting. Oh my god, look at all the enemies. Where is it wanting to take me? So we have a node management here, which is nice. Discover the node real quick. Get out of there, get out of there. I just wanted to discover the node. So let's go, let's keep going in here. Let's take, let's explore a little bit because who knows, I probably won't ever come back here on this character. 
so we might as well have a little bit of fun here while we're while we're here. Let's head let's head up this way. I'm just gonna spin the wind because it really does kill essentially everything in my path. How close are we? We're pretty close to completing this. Clean those up. Okay, you can stop stop the attack. Um, let's see. I'm gonna, hold on, I'm gonna track enemies. Can I take a quick peek at my map? Nope. I just wanted to take one little look. You guys couldn't let me have that. So we just need, uh, Rifleman's Hoods and Plunderers. Can I have, I just want to look at the map real quick, game. Wait, work with me real quick here. There's, like, nowhere where there isn't enemies. The mob density is actually pretty good. Actually, kind of. So this area is actually probably a little bit better. Oh, my God. Not another. Not, no, 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 no. Slaughter these idiots and go away. No, no. I don't want to fight another one. Oh, my God. Leave me alone. Heal. We're just going to run away. Leave me alone. I don't want to fight another one of you. You were super annoying and you gave me garbage rewards. Okay, so let's get up the hill here. I would like to take a look at my map to see in terms of where I am. Is it still following me? I don't think so. Um, nothing is really following me anymore. You die, get out of here. And then you. Okay, so now I can take a look at my map real quick. So now I want to look at this for long. So we're at essentially, eh, actually, you can follow this around. It looks like over into this area, which I have never, well, so, yeah, I've never gone, like, over here. So we could check that out. I don't know how worth it is to check that out, but that's also an option. I'm assuming we'll probably go there eventually anyway, based on story quests and whatnot, but I could be wrong. I'm assuming it wraps around the desert, so I'll take a look at it here again in a second. We gotta kill plunderers. Collect black hoods from the plunderers. How does that not hit you through there? And spin the wind through this group. Here we go. Can I get a plunderer's black hood? Hello? Are my pets... No, I'll feed my pets since I'm in this menu, but why are my pets not picking up any plunders? I'm kind of out of where I need to be, I think, because these the mob density now is just cheap. So let me, before I go on an adventure away from where we are, let's get the main quest done that we're working on. And then, then I'll dick around with some other random BS, but... I do need to complete this. We're still at 10 out of 15. This, okay. Why am I not finding any of these anymore? Hello? There's 11. Okay. At least we found one. I was gonna say, why, like, is something glitched? But no, it's just, like, being really annoying. Woo, still at 11. How many of these do I have to kill? I just looked at the levels that I've gained from this video, and it's, like, below zero. It's like, it's like I didn't even do anything. The level up grind is gonna be, it's gonna be something special. We're still at 11. Hello? How many plunderers do I have to murder, game? All the plunderers. There we go. There was a double plunder pickup. Hopefully this plunderer will drop me one. No, we're still at 13. This is this is actually kind of impressive that I can't get a freaking plunderer's hood. Hello? I don't know what is happening. Give me one plunderer's hood. Oh, we're at 14 now. We did get one. Da -da -da. Hello? Uh, let's go back up this way. 
try to find. We need one more plunder's hood. One freaking more plunder's hood. We got a couple of plunders here. Let's see if we can get it here. And there it is. We finally got the final plunder's hood. I'm going to quick select the quest so I can see. I will kill... Well, hold on. We'll do this. And then I should be able to take... Uh, no. I got hit by the guy at the back. Usually you can pull that up if they're all in front of you because they're all, like, stunned. But I was not in the perfect spot for that. Guy came up from behind and slapped me. Are you still up Oh, she's still up here. Nope, 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 nope. Go the other way, go the other way, go the other way. I want to see how far away it is, and then I'll decide on what we're going to do to finish off this episode, because we are at the 20-minute mark. So I want to figure out what I want to do. So we're going to run over here again. And I'm going to hop on the rock. And if anything, actually, let's do... Okay, I don't think anything's going to come up here. Okay, so it wants us to go all the way back to here. I'm going to assume we turn that quest in and it's going to take us somewhere else. So I'm going to go, let's explore a little bit out and around. So it's night, so I can't really see the map. So let's just take a little bit of an exploring route here. Let's go take a peek up here and see what we got. I don't know. I would like to find, like, one node out here, and then I'd probably be happy. But let's take a look. I have no idea where this takes me, what's out here, if there's anything of a note out here, or if it's just kind of... Just kind of a area. More, more of the sandstorm people. Looks like it looks like they're thinning out enemy wise, so it might be swapping over to a new area. So that's just a trap. Eh, they're still kind of following me. I'll get up here and then I'll stop and take a look at what it might be just taking us into the desert, which also wouldn't surprise me at all. Which is what it appears like it's doing. I mean, we're kind of far away from the desert, but that's what it kind of looks like. This just looks like a desert area. If I start getting heat stroke, I'll kind of just know. But, I don't know. I kind of like I kind of like just coming out here and exploring different shit, but... We got a random... S so that's another... That's just another sandstorm, dude. Okay, so let's hap what happens if we just run into the ether here? We're entering a dangerous zone. You may be attacked by adventures of evil karma. It's fine. Let's see. I mean, this is just... Oh, this is the great desert. Okay, we're in the desert now. So if I pull up my map, yeah, we're just in here somewhere. So that just connects to the desert. So this whole area out here is just big-ass desert. Just big ass desert. So we want to run back. So I guess that's going to do it for the video, guys. I'll get us to a point where we got some more side qu or we got more main quests to do. Like like I said, we're trying to just get to Camasylvia. Then I'll do more in depth stuff with Camasylvia once we get there. Because I never did it, but we need to progress this character to a reasonable um, a reasonable progression. I don't want to go. I, I don't want to go to Camasylvia and, like, skip this, because then we'll do Camasylvia, and then we'll come back to this, and it'll seem so utterly pointless to do this. So I'd rather do this first, then do Camasylvia, but that's what we're going to be focusing on Black Desert-wise. Like I said, I'm going to be focusing on getting my skills and getting better with Sorceress here. Um, I'm going to watch some videos, try to figure out some better stuff that I can do, stuff that... You know, just different stuff. I don't want to be, like, optimal. I don't care about being optimal. But I I obviously know that I can play the character a lot better than I'm playing her. So that's what I'm going to be focused on. But uh, that's going to do it, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.